everyone. Hey, this is a final, uh, final JLP interaction video, and this is my partner Sarah. And we're gonna talk some feelings about this event. Um, the first is, what kind of strong feeling did you experience before, during, or after your interaction? Well, I felt shocked to hear about the differences between the culture in China and the U.S. for high school because I think that it's really hard to understand a different culture outside your own when you've been in, in your own culture so much. So I was really shocked to hear the differences. Yeah, and before I came to the U.S., I had never been abroad, even though I went to an international school. Oh, I didn't have an opportunity to in interact with people from different country, so I'm truly curious about different culture. Yeah, what will happen is various culture first together. During my discussion with my partner days ago, I strong strongly felt the difference between culture of China and America, even though I had already thought about how massive the distinction will be. I was also shocked. And for the next problem, what are some things you thought or felt differently about as a result of this interaction? Um, I felt differently that I should consider cultures more closely and how different they can be and maybe look into that and kind of appreciate how different cultures can have different standards. Um, for me, the first we talk about the most common things in China and the U.S. For instance, the word girlfriend means completely in China and in U.S. In China, girlfriend only means male or female are in relationship. They might break up with each other anytime when they feel inappropriate to be a couple. However, if a male from U.S. introduce a girl to other by using the word girlfriend, they're in a serious relationship and will get and will get married sooner or later. Sa secondly, we talk about the rules because as an educator, they are plenty of rules I need to remember and I'll obey. Because of huge population, Chinese people will violate some rules and to make others achieve their targets easy. Only in this way can Chinese people help others if each one of Chinese people obey the rules fairly. Most people will experience inconvenience. However, the kind of situation will really, really help happen in U.S. Last but not least, parents from China will help their children to find a job, purchase a house, where as Americans need to um, really own themselves to lead, to lead a pleasant life. During this talk, we barely found similarities between two countries. We both felt astonishing. astonishing. And the third question is about what kind of learn about yourself is positive or negative from this interaction? Uh, I learned that I had a positive experience um, when I was in high school because there wasn't as much stress put on certain aspects of being in high school. Um, for me, I don't feel any negative influence during this talk because I've learned plenty of knowledge which will help me get prepared to be an educator in the future and the different education styles must help me know which one is suited for me. And the first question is, as a result of this interaction, what might you do? differently as a MSU student? Well, I might talk to more people to understand what school was like in their culture and kind of compare it to how things were like for me. Um, so you can learn a lot by talking to people from other cultures and other countries. Yeah, and for me, I will, I will change. For me, I I will change some of habits and imitate 
American way. Well, I study MSU. All in all, the discussion of cultural difference will help both people and provide a better, better prospect. And the last problem: How might this experience influence you as a learner and a possible educator? Well, I think that it could help me learn a lot. And in the future, I could absorb more information and be a better person. Oh,、um, for me, if I if I am fortunate and become an educator in U.S. or back in my homeland, I could introduce the introduce this experience to my student in U in U.S. I could present Chinese culture, for example, Chinese food. Um. Even if these kind of things do not seem seem to be familiar with America, this will make the discussion between America and the Chinese easily. Same situation will happen if I if I become a teacher in China. More and more teenage teenagers decided to go abroad and get advanced education, and the U.S. will more likely to become the first choice.、Mm. That's it. <laughs>